Hello everyone, and welcome to Debutante Brawl. Um, so, this is a bit of an update. I've got two things. I've got an update and a new announcement. Um, <clears throat> we'll start with the update. The update is that, uh, first of all, we're at, um, let's see, 67 days until GRS, and uh, it was going to be in Florida, but uh, it turns out that um, Dr. McGinn is not going to be performing anything, any surgeries in Florida yet when I have a schedule, when I have my appointment scheduled. So um, instead I'll be going to Pennsylvania, which um, uh, I thought it'd be kind of nice to go to, to go to Key West, but um, I think I'll end up saving some money by going to Pennsylvania. I think it's a little cheaper. And they're opening up a guest house, um, like, a, like a recovery house, um, kind of like how uh, Marcy Bowers has it. And um, I guess uh, Donna Rose is, is heading that up. It's her deal. And I don't know. It's, it's whatever. My mom is still going to come and visit me. I was afraid that it being in Pennsylvania, that and my mother living in Florida, that she would not um, as readily be able to come and visit. But she's, she is. So she's just waiting to find out when I want her to come. Um, what I think I'm going to do is I think that I'm not going to have anyone come and visit me while I'm in the hospital. I mean, I'm going to be, like, drugged up. I'm gonna be doing my own thing. It's gonna be kind of I don't know. I don't I don't want people seeing me in the hospital bed. Whatever. I'm just that. Whatever. I'm gonna let that be my own thing. I'm gonna like bring my laptop, do some projects or something. Um, but then you know, like uh, I think maybe then I'll have my mom maybe maybe help me move from the hospital to the to the guest house or whatever. Whether I do that at the hotel, I'm not sure. So gonna do that. Um, crazy. It's crazy. In 67 days, GRS and breast augmentation. Jesus. That's a lot of stuff going on. Wow. I just, I don't like the, the trans stuff, like, taking up too much of my time and my thoughts, but, you know, how can it not at this point? It's, um, it's just, it's like every day thinking about it and, um, you know, making sure, like, I'm, spending money wisely, uh, so that I can, you know, <laughs> afford everything. Um, I'm, uh, I'm pretty much have all the money I need to cover all the surgeries. Um, but now it's just a matter of, of saving, um, enough for travel expenses and, and, uh, just paying rent while I'm, you know, while I'm not working. Um, but making really good progress. And it's just so much money. It's crazy. It's crazy how how expensive this stuff is. But what? Are the JJ's cheap? I don't think so. Um, so yeah, there's that. Was there any other aspect to that news? I mean, I guess I don't remember what I said last time. I mean, I've I've pretty much done everything that I need to. I've um, just yesterday I sent I took some pictures of my chest section, you know, the doctor needs, uh, you know, to gauge what size, you know, how many cc's, whatever, for the breast dog, and, um, uh, I've gotten all my medical stuff done, I guess the results are back, my doctor was just sort of sitting on them, and I called, and I was like, so, are we still waiting, and he's like, no, 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 we're gonna send it off, what's the fax number of the doctor, and I was like, what? you're asking me now, like, I, I gave you their, I don't know, so anyways. <clears throat> and that doctor office kind of drives me crazy sometimes. Um, and, you know, I just found out that um, I got my letters signed, and uh, apparently they're in the mail. They should get to the Papillon Center this week, so letters and doctor stuff and photos and money, I mean, that's really the biggie, the big thing. Um, so that's it. That's my big update with the GRS, SRS stuff. Um, thank you, everyone, for, you know, your warm congrats and everything else. And, um, <clears throat> excuse me, it's really, ni really nice to hear all that. I am sick again. I have a cold. And you know what? Uh, <laughs> fancy Ellie. Ellie Emma. Um, don't give me shit about it. Like, I, I am, like, sick in half my videos, I swear to God. Uh, but I have a reason. I've just been, I've been freelancing like crazy. Um, I'm working at a new, a new shop this month, and uh, I've been trying to finish this music video. 
on the side, and I've been sick twice during this music video post-production process, and it's just put me out, you know, I mean, I, I can't come home from work and then work on that at night, so it just, like, there's, like, three weeks of the last two months or so that just, I just, I just haven't worked on anything. Um, and then there's another side project, and then I worked on another side project. This other company hired me to do some, some side graphics. So I did that. <clears throat> Excuse me. I mean, I'll let you know. I guess I did some 3D for a TV show opening. I don't know when that's coming out. I can't really talk about which show it is. Maybe I'll, if you remind me, I'll mention it later on. Um, but I don't know if it's going to look very good. So I might not tell you. Okay, but this leads me to the other bit of news, the other announcement. Um, I finished the music video that I, uh, that, I made, that I made for a friend of mine in, um, in New York. <coughs> My friend Roberto, um, his band, his current band, or one of his projects, is uh, Helado Negro. And um, he came out with a new album called A-O, like um, A-W-E, O-W-E. I think it's A-O. It's O-A or A-O. I think it's A-O. And um, as far as I know, it's the only first his first album in Spanish. Um, I'm like bad throat. Um, so uh, uh, the song is called Ver a Ver, and um, I don't know. So it was really awesome that he uh, he asked me to make it. So um, I don't know if I've even talked about this at all. Um, he let me choose any song on the album, minus one that that a music video was already made by another by another director in New York. And uh, so I picked this one song, and you know I, I came up with an idea. Um, I cast it. I have you know I cast the two actors. Um, I hired a makeup artist. Uh, we shot it in my backyard, um, and uh, I used my my Canon 5D Mark II. Uh, DS, DSLR, which also shoots some um, high-def video, uh, and it's really beautiful. And then my friend has the same camera, um, but he has, um, <clears throat> excuse me, this Red Rock Micro, like, housing for it, and it has, like, you know, full professional matte box and, uh, you know, like, handle and, like, a rig for, like, for, like, going handheld, you know, and his little monitor, so, you know, like, you can shoot outside and, you don't have to like look at the back of the camera, you know, that can be over here and you're just looking at the monitor. And it has follow focus and everything. It's a really cool kit. Um, it's like a three thousand dollar kit. I mean, maybe that's that's not really that bad. I mean, for that amount of money, like what he has is pretty amazing. And um, so I shot it myself. Um, I had some friends cater and then some of my other friends, you know, helped out and, you know, held the uh, held the reflector. There's no lighting, it's all sunlight. And one reflector that I that I like, I have a reflector kit, and it's maybe like this big or something like that. And it's a a mixed silver gold reflector. Um, so shot it, and then I I edited it and did all the effects. You know, so there's like a couple, there's like six, no, there's about eight shots I think that are um, that have uh, CGI. So you know, like three D tracked them or 2D tracked them, depending on the shot, did the 3D, animated it, comped it in, and uh, then threw a color correct over it, and After Effects, all that stuff was, um, all that treatment was After Effects, and all the 3D was Cinema 4D, tracking with, with synth eyes, um, and, uh, and now it's done. And now it's, um, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm hosting it on, on Vimeo, not on here, I haven't decided whether I'll use, whether I'll post it on here or not. I kind of um that's sort of the account we use to like post work. Like I don't really think that it's appropriate for me to put it on here in case a lot of people see this version. Um and then it's like linked back to you know these these you know these vlogs and it's kind of this is a personal channel. So anyways, I'm putting a link whatever side it is. I think it's that side. And um check it out. Tell me what you think. And uh if you're an awesome, amazing band or production company, hire me to do short form directing. Okay.